Hey, I'm Laura. Just quickly, we here at Grit TV are proud to bring you independently produced content every day. Now it's your chance to help us. Grit TV has been offered a $100,000 challenge grant. Every dollar you give right now between now and June 30th is worth $3 to us. We've only got a few more weeks to meet the match. Will you help? You can donate at our website, grittv.org. Meanwhile, enjoy this clip. Yeah, I mean, I think that she, this is one of the reasons why she serves as such a convenient muse for the right, um, that her philosophies, even, even insofar as they extend to gender, don't run very deep. Um, and I think that's why the project, her project, and maybe the project of, I think the parallel with Hollywood is so interesting and important, because they're doing the same thing. They're sort of creating this um, easily accessible world, which isn't very deep and doesn't actually get into the problems of gender, which are structural and systematic. And that's where I think feminists resist her, um, even though you can see some admiration for her um, as a public figure and taking on what must have been a lot of you know, vitriol towards her. Am I crazy to be hearing kind of echoes of Sarah Palin? <laughs> no, I mean, I think that's a very good parallel. And, 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 I think the, 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 the point that Aisha is making about the flatness of that point of view is really important and it's critical. Um, there is no depth in that kind of point of view and that's part of its attraction. It says that you can apprehend the world at its surface. She loved this, uh, this uh, epigram from Aristotle. It didn't really come from him. A is A. What does that say? That is that the world is what it is and nothing more. There's nothing more to be said about it. I've said everything there is to be said about the world. And I think that's people like... People like exactly that kind of living on the flatness of that surface.